London. Lizzie, Allie, and I are leaving tomorrow. I think it's one of those cities that's made for me. So I'm really fitted to go. communication between Liz and I after the whole Greece fiasco. Do you want to go to Greece? I'd love to go, okay, but I don't know the language, I don't know the people. It's a little scary. It's, I think we should just go to London. Do you think that Liz will get mad at us? Well, here's my situation. I just feel like sometimes, like, Liz resents me for being so close to you. Well, Jamie, you accept me for me, and you understand me more than anyone else. I was pretty much terrified because she's a very passive person. She doesn't communicate very well when she has a problem. So I talked to Liz about Grace. Oh. I'm sad about it. I just want to go back. You guys should have just told me. Like, I won't care. I don't want you to be unhappy. I've known Liz for a year. Allie has known Liz her whole life. I think she's a little uncomfortable with my friendship with Allie. Liz seems to think that time is directly related to the quality of the friendship. I talked to Liz a little bit last night about the Grace thing. And she's so over it and fine. And she was like, I understand like your anxiety attacks and stuff like that. And she was just like, there are other times to go. Like, I love her because she does take things like into positive. Like, good, like, we're gonna have a great time in London together. Very good friend. Fifteen years we've been friends. Fifteen. We really had, like, a great time last night. We missed you a lot. It was good for us to have alone time as well, you know? Right here. Thanks. on a plane that Allie's mother had chartered. I'm just like really, really grateful that my parents are kind enough to provide us with the safety of having a private plane. When someone else is there, it's very hard for me to be completely 